Previously on Survivor Wiperus, the Rundle tribe managed a shocking comeback against Yamnuska. Before Tribal Council, Keegan told Moira and Kelsey that Eric had thrown Moira under the bus. Together, the three managed to convince the rest of the tribe to take out Eric as a threat, leaving Mitch in the dark. Thirteen remain. Who will be voted out next? Looks like everybody is ready for the next challenge. Rundle, looking rested, ready to perform. There are a few things for us to take care of before we hop into our next challenge. First things first, Yamnuska, why don't you send me voted off off the edge to join flow? Oh. Same reaction. Rundle, <laughs> you have an immunity, I don't know that belongs to me. <laughs> Thank you very much, Megan. No problem. Okay. The game is narrowing down. Everyone seems to be hitting a good rhythm. And in that spirit, I need you all to drop your buffs. What? Okay. We will be doing a tribe swap, as I'm sure many of you have picked up on at this point. I hope you are all ready to pivot with your social dynamics, because I honestly don't know where you're going to end up after this. Once we get the tribe started out, I will break down our next challenge, the Max Nagel Memorial Relay. Oh, and I, that sounds like an awful sign. <laughs> <laughs> One at a time, I will get you all to step forward, reach into the bag, and grab a burlap sack. Well, we'll start over here with Kelsey. Okay, looks like everybody is just uncomfortable enough to start opening their sacks. Open up those burlap bags. Red. Red. Hey. <laughs> Conrad. Let's go. Everybody, go to the Conrad, you sit right there. As you may note, Conrad has picked the black buff. He yes. will then be sent temporarily to the edge with me. However, whoever is sent, whoever is going to be voted out, will be swapping their position with Conrad. So Conrad will then be joining that that specific tribe. Okay. But in the meantime, Conrad, come and join. Come and join your comrades. 
Yeah. The rest of you, get ready to your new tribes. We have Yamnuska. We have Rundle. And the new yellow tribe is Cascade. So being put into the uh, the sabbatical to exile was not my my first choice. Um, I'm not sure what uh, what this entails for for where I'll end up, but. There's some information to be learned. There's members of the former Rundle tribe that I can talk to to really figure out how, how their tribe dynamic worked, if they were willing to talk to me. And so I think wherever I slot back into the, the top three, I'll have a, a solid idea of where alliances are, where, where cracks that we can exploit are. And the team, the people are together, and, uh, the two girls are together. Okay. Um, Jackson is still in because he's running an idol, uh, basically. Mm -hmm. And also because he's got a coach and teacher personality. Mm -hmm. And then um, there's uh, uh, Krish, who I think is, uh, or was likely to go to at that point, but maybe he can integrate better with. You know, some people he knows now, I think he's in a much better position. What, what, put, you, what put you before Krish? Um, because it was... Um, was it performance? Or? I think, you know, they, they just went really to, to vote Krish on the bat. But, I had a yeah. very reasonable read that on, on the factions. I just thought they'd be a little more coalescing against Jackson. <laughs> But that's mm -hmm. I think this he's, new he's dynamic. Like, is interesting. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So wait, let's I mean let's let's review the tribes and let's do a the green tribe would be a good tribe to swap back to, except I don't think they're great challenges and you may be going back to the back to the tribal council at least once more if I go back there. I have the most friends there. Welcome aboard. Thank you. We are just going to win this challenge and we're yeah. just going to observe whatever happens over there. He can Kelsey can fish. I think you can be just there. I think, they they think the middle, like Cam and Keegan, that group, they're they're going to be really good if it's a puzzle challenge. Thing. I said some bad things about Rundle. But you know what? <laughs> and now he's on. But you know what? On, on second thought, I think it's the best tribe in the game. I actually couldn't remember what the <laughs> tribe name was. Like the Nuts tribe or something. We just call ourselves Yams. Yams. <laughs> I literally couldn't remember. I was calling you green. The whole time. I honestly think that this is pretty like, good. Yeah, it's going to be interesting to see the dynamics of, like, okay, we're putting someone to help with Conrad's coming back after. Exactly. Honestly, I think that this is pretty good. Like, it's going to be interesting. Yeah. yeah. Let's just wait. Oh, yeah. The plan is still like not us. Like, and with three tribes, you have left a chance to. Yeah. You can be pretty comfortable that I'm Cascade comfortable. won't lose. I think. Because, but if you get put to Cascade, you're screwed. Which one, Cascade? Yellow. Yeah. yeah. Yellow is Jackson, Derek, Robin, and Colin. Chance smiled upon us, and that we all know each other, and we were all working together before. Thank God, I don't have to remember any new names. <laughs> <laughs> and frankly, doing a, a full assessment of each of each tribe, Yam is full of friendly faces. On Rundle, pretty easy to, to see where that might go. Could be surprised. Rundle's team is split down the middle. No matter what happens, I can always bring back a, a Yam unity, assuming that that keeps Cascade. All, all strangers. First of all, I'd like to welcome all three of you wonderful tribes to the Max Nagel Memorial Relay. This relay is a wonderful memorial to that man's suffering throughout that first season of Survivor. And with that in mind, it's important that I break down what makes the Max Nagel Memorial Relay so interesting. First of all, each team will nominate a shooter. The shooters will all take turns shooting at that crisp pills from that tree back there where the gun is. For each shot missed, your team has to do two additional suicides. Each team starts at three. The first team to complete their suicides will find themselves at a donut station with three different sizes of donuts. Obviously, the first team there has their pick of the litter and they nominate one eater from their group to eat the donut without their hands. <laughs> so, it's best to get your suicides done quickly. From there, where there are three slide puzzles. Two of the slide puzzles are the same, 
and one of them is unbelievably un uncharacteristically <laughs> difficult, and I wish you good luck. The moral of the story is this. Do not come in last place, because if you do, I can guarantee you, unless you are exceptionally gifted, you will not have an easy time with that side puzzle. Cascade, Yamnesco, Rundel, please send your shooters forward. Okay. I will just go over the rules once again. Each of you will be shooting from this tree at that can of pills hanging from that tree in the distance. It's the yellow and brown can. Okay? Your teams already have to run three suicides. For each shot that you miss, you add two suicides to that tally. Is that clear? Yep. Yeah. You guys will just take turns shooting. You guys can determine who you want to go first, who you want to go last. That's up to you. Once everyone has hit the can, we will tally up the suicides, and all of us will march on over to the suicide point, we'll define the rules of that, and then the real relay will start. And that is a miss. That is Yeah, you run yeah. as many of the suicides yeah. as you physically as, can, like, and then you're like, like, I'm gas. Like, it's better if someone else like chimes yeah. in. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, how are you with slide puzzles? Um, I haven't done slide puzzles, but I feel like I am probably. Gonna What's a slide good. puzzle? The first two tribes to finish win immunity. Last tribe will see me at tribal council. Survivors ready? Go! Slide, Megan. One more. You got this. Cascade up to a good start. Jackson in a narrow go, lead, go, 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 right go, behind go. him. That is one done. Everybody with one done. Megan opting to do two for her tribe, while the others rotate off. Keep up the energy. Catching up, Chris. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Even with Cascade, and they're off. Megan makes it back. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Strides for Cascade. Robin's off. I'll go after you. Keegan's off. Moira's off. All of them. Hey! Hey! Oh, oh man, Keegan! Where's the puzzles? Yeah, but we they gotta swallow first. You gotta swallow and then mouth open. Derek, are you okay? Go, Evan, go. Yeah. You got this, Evan! You got we this! Got one one for you after, man. Okay, you're good. Let's go, Gotta follow it. that go, Dude, you got follow this. It. Follow it! Follow it! Good? One more. On, you got this, Keegan? Come Evan, on, still Come chewing. On. There we go. Nice. go, baby, go! There we go. Come on. Right. Yeah, Keegan! And in for the Yamnesca and Cascade on the easier slide puzzles! Yamnesca and Cascade, Moira and Robin, sliding pieces around. It's been so long since I've done some Side puzzles are a cornerstone of the game. We make other people do so. I know. They have run head first into that challenge. Go, go, go. Please don't kill my brother. Great work, Keegan. Just take your time. Yeah, you got this. On it. Okay. This slide puzzle. It looks like we are almost in a dead heat. No, we. No. 
Ah. He's clear. He's good. Let's go. Oh, Great job, man. Nice. Kind of events for the Cascade Tribe. As things continue to slide oh, into position, so Robin oh. <laughs> may be even closer than previously seen. Making great yeah. progress for the Cascade yeah. Tribe. Cam tackling another puzzle for his team. Go work, man. Kill this. The Puzzle Meister of Rundle leaps to the challenge. He has the hardest slide puzzle in Survivor Wipers history. The Max Nagel Memorial Relay takes no prisoners. No. No. You're so close, you're so close. Robin may have made incredible progress. Done? Done! Oh, yes! Robin, yeah! Four Cascade yeah! is the first one done! He's still oh, one! Yeah! Yeah! Woohoo! Bring it in. Cascade! What an incredible effort! Well done! Oh, now yes, we can! Three, two, one! Cascade! And now you all get to watch. Are you just Cam. Still decoding the words on the slide puzzle beforehand. Working fast though. As Moira still just desperately trying to figure out how to get the middle of this puzzle in its place. Cam getting very, very close. What a monumental effort from Rundle. It's very, very confusing to have to solve. Opposite? Like not like, the corner missing. Yeah. You got this. Got this, dude. Both exceeded the amount of time that you have for this challenge. We are going to take a quick five minute break for each of you. The production team is going to re-scramble oh. the picture puzzles, portions of them, and you will have to solve what we have for you. Go take a five minute break. Okay, go take it away from the sun for a bit. Okay, go breathe. We're gonna go with job. Dalton is the first tribe to finish their sliding puzzle. It secures immunity. One tribe, the other, assuming a tribe of puzzle. Not quite. That's it. Cam got it. Oh yeah, yeah. Sit. Sit. Cascade! I believe this beautiful thing belongs Woo! to you guys. Rob, take that away. You also win these. I would recommend putting those to use. Yeah, Rundle! Yeah, what yeah, a Come back. You are safe from the vote. You will see me at Tribal Council in I am feeling kind of sad and disheartened. Like, I knew where all the pieces were supposed to go. Like, I was really quick on knowing that. But it was just getting them into the place that was really frustrating and hard. Um, so that, that felt bad. Back on the edge, the survivors are faced with their next challenge. The rules of giant beer pong are nearly identical to the classic beer pong game. There are two teams of two and three buckets per team. Survivors will have to shoot a ball into the buckets of the opposing team to eliminate the bucket. The first team to eliminate all of the other team's buckets wins. If players bounce the ball onto the spike ball net before landing it into a bucket, the team gets an immediate win. There's one additional spicy twist in this edge game. Conrad, our temporary edge E, has the chance to win an advantage in this game. If Conrad and his teammate manage to win this challenge, he will gain an advantage that he can use once he's back in the game. This advantage allows him to remove somebody from a challenge unless they can shotgun a beer in seven seconds. Oh! I try. 
Yeah, Jackson, how do you feel about Eric's performance? <laughs> <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh. 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 <laughs> Oh. Mm. Here we go. Great. Okay. Kale and Eric, winners of challenge number three. I don't think any of us are winners after that. <laughs> Ooh, just don't start a forest fire. Don't tell me what to do. <laughs> we were figuring out an alliance between her, me, Cam, and Megan. But she never got the oh, chance no, to tell so Megan about it. <laughs> I'm sure Megan would be down. Yeah. But now the problem is Megan's on the team that's up for elimination. Mm -hmm. um, and she's on a tribe with like three other people are from the same tribe, so she's the odd one out. But we can't really help her out until no. it goes to no teams. Mm -hmm. But I'm thinking like if we go up for elimination, like I, let's just take Derek out. I <laughs> I'm so sorry. He, he struggled to even eat a fucking dip. <laughs> I was actually swapped onto a team with four or three of my other tribe members, so I think it was a really good fit. We didn't really need to make any new relationships. Um, <laughs> the the challenge itself was really stressful, and I was so worried that I was gonna mess it up for our team. But I think I came in clutch and was able to pull off the puzzle, which secured our team a victory but um i think going forward the teams of four is really tough to be in because connell and i have a pretty good alliance i don't think that he's gonna go back on that anytime soon but we haven't been super discreet about it um and i think that jackson has caught on for sure and jackson would be a great ally but i'm not sure that he's necessarily on board yet. Okay. Hell yeah, you are. That is all. Okay. Surprise, there's a tribe switch, which is why I'm wearing red now, which is fine. It looks good with my outfit. I'm not mad about it. Okay. Because I was sure he had played it because he came back with my pocket. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Okay. The, the Eric vote, the Eric vote was a blindside, and we didn't tell Mitchell because we didn't want a repeat of Mitchell having to betray Eric. That's fair, yeah. We took feelings into consideration. Neil was Yeah. Okay. My stomach hurts. <laughs> it was worth it because we won the challenge, but I'm not going to look forward to uh, to looking back on that footage. You might actually be the more the edge. The more challenges you win, the more advantages you get to come in. So if you but get the there last, the question in, is, is the advantage helping you get back in, or is the advantage that you come back in with? Oh. Um, because like, because like, edge of extinction, kind of edge of extinction gives both. you, you can buy, uh... Edge of extinction was both. Yeah, because you could buy the idol and you could also... Exactly. Okay, also, I think that they're going to be drinking game themed, and if cups are an advantage, I wonder if it's going to be like a cup stacking game. No, I think it's, I think it's Pong. As soon as they're drinking, mm -hmm. oh, it's Pong. Yeah. And you get the amount of solo cups yeah. on your board as, uh... Keegan, I met him once. We played an online Survivor Disc group where he absolutely fucked me up. Haha, <laughs> you killed me in it? So, um, a little nervous about him, but I also want to work with him. He's a smart guy, he knows a strategy. Um, Cam is somebody who I want to work with because I think we, 
we have a fairly similar style of gameplay, which is aggressive but loyal to the people we pick. I've now picked Moira and Kelsey to be those people after the last Tribal Council, and I'm hoping it can stay that way after uh, the Tribal Council that the Yams went to uh, with Moira uh, having a difficult time in the last challenge. I'm hoping that Moira can stick around and they can keep those numbers going. If we do go to Tribal Council, I'm going to try and keep it being me, Kelsey, Cam. Promising Cam that he'll have a spot. And that I mean that seriously. Who do they vote for? Probably me. I think so. That would be a big team. Yeah, that's fine though. Like, yeah. I'll go for a Yes, yeah, yeah. it's worth it. Like, cause especially since I'm pretty sure Megan's screwed right now. And she's, yeah. she's got and a one to three. Either of us go for one, like the other one's gone. And she's like, just call Megan comes in and it's a three. Yeah, that's right. One of our safest times is one out of the universe. Oh, there's just four right there. But still, that's actually way better for you. Yeah, because it'll be a. Because even if we call one of them out, we'd have to do the exact same thing. Yeah. yeah. Going to rocks twice. Oh, fuck. Megan and I are still together. We are now with um, Cam and Krish. So we got a good K team. Are you listening to me? Don't listen. I'm talking shit about you, Keegan. I would never. I feel pretty secure. Um, like maybe I am seen as the weak link, but not yet. Uh, I also feel like I got Keegan, and since there's only four of us, it's kind of split um, with just like tribal loyalty, so I'm good. I'm just going to keep playing. Uh, I got paired up with Keegan, Kelsey, and Chris from my original tribe. Keegan and Kelsey work for my original tribe. A little worried about Keegan. He's always been a little wary of me, so we'll see how that goes. Right now, it's there's four of us on the tribe with a 2 2 split. So, if we go to tribal, Chris claims he'd go to rocks for me. Would I go to rocks for him? Probably fucking not. Maybe. It depends. I'm hoping I can work something out with Keegan, maybe take Kelsey out, or maybe vice versa, work with Kelsey to get Keegan out. I'd rather Keegan stay in. The challenge involved a slide puzzle. I had to do the hard one that Max competed in last time, and I did. You know, I mean, I went over the limit. Fucking puzzles are shit. But I was close, and I think people realize that. So I'm hoping that doesn't make me some, some, some sort of puzzle threat. But either way, as far as everything's going, I'm feeling not horrible. Could be in a worse spot, that's for sure. A little disappointed I haven't found any free drinks yet. That's the, that's the real issue here. I was telling my team, I know I'm at a disadvantage here. I'm the newbie. Got, I'm the only one that was not originally on this track. <laughs> so I know I'm coming in, but I promise I can bring it. And like I said, I have some good intel on some of the other teams, especially that team that is all comprised entirely of my old teammates mm. that I think would really come in and advantage later in the game. That's fair. And so you'll hold off on that until after. I think I have to. I have to. <laughs> yeah, that's my bargain. That's my bargaining piece. So. Uh, yeah. No, that's fair. I was going to reveal that Jackson has an immunity idol. And that he's, because I was in previously in an alliance with them. And we kind of had some plans. And I was thinking that we'd probably use that to kind of make some moves here. Um, but they don't necessarily know that that's all I know. I, all I said was that I have valuable information. No, I did not win at the puzzle, so that feels bad, um, but yeah. I've been very strong in other challenges, so it's, it's hard. I, I, I know what you mean. I mean, it was, uh, I feel like we had a good chance to win that challenge, and it was a little frustrating to see it fall apart at the end there. Um, I really hoped we didn't have to come to Tribal Council here, but I feel like we can we can figure this one out pretty easily, but we'll have to see, I guess. I've, uh, I, le I set out to try to avoid Tribal Councils, and I've been to three out of four now, so it's definitely not how I plan this game to go, but... Um, anything else we want to say as a group before we split up? All right. Should we just rotate in pairs? Two people go off and we'll fucking just rotate through this? I mean, it's a very fair way to do some sneaky yeah. shit. Yeah, I'm kind of here for it. It. <laughs> it, is, it is fair. Okay, okay give me one coffee. All right, come on, boys. All right. One target now. Um, so just so you know, in our last tribal council, Eric and Mitchell wanted to vote me out. Okay. And everyone was like, 
no, Eric, you're the one who screwed the, like he's the one who kept saying don't put anything in it the whole time. But he, he like waited until I went to the washroom and then told everybody that he wanted oh, so he, me so out. So the so. sneaky shit was a fly. Um, Mitchell, it flew, it flew with Mitchell, but Evan was like, that was super aggro. So in my mind, I kind of want to get Mitchell out okay. just because he tried to vote me out and I know he's going to target me. So I know that's going to be his pitch. Um, Evan's been solid. Also just trying to maintain a positive attitude about the loss, you know, it's bound to happen. I know Moira tried her very best and that's all we can ask of our teammates, so. It's frustrating to lose like that, I won't lie, but at the same time, I do have to think about like, are the original tribes gonna stick together? Because if they are, then we have the chance to equalize it right now. Um, it is possible, but yeah, I, I really think we need to like, because like, we're gonna have probably at least another maybe four, five, six rounds yeah. in the team. So I mean like, we need to, we need to be as strong as possible. Right? Yeah. Um, so like, because we, we're gonna get Connor out regardless if we vote out. He's coming back with us. It's like that, mm -hmm. oh that, that is true, that is true. Yeah. Um, okay, that, that's, that makes it a little bit, that makes it, that makes it hurt a little bit less. Yeah. Um, I'm, like unfortunately to say like, I feel like my vote is towards Moira yeah. at the moment. I mean like, the, like she definitely did really well at the other puzzle. This one was, yeah, it was it, a little, it, she she just couldn't grasp how to how to do it at the end there. She couldn't figure out how to switch the two pieces. Yeah, um, which, which does hurt. And I mean, like, I don't know. I, I think like we can do other other puzzle challenges together. I mean, like, yeah, I feel I, like I, you you I, seem I, to grasp it pretty I, well. I think I would have been able to do it. Yeah, I, I just couldn't do both the shooting and that. Uh, totally. Yeah. And I felt getting to the. Puzzle 100%. Was, was the was the. I thought that was such a big advantage not getting that uh, the last puzzle that yeah. we had to do. So. I know just, just getting. I totally think that we, we definitely gave ourselves a really good chance to get there, but we just couldn't finish it. Again, so yeah, got the impression that the other tribe was not 100 percent together. Yeah, and it, it sounds kind of like there was a group of them, and if we kind of bring her over to our side, we could probably yeah. kind of tackle that group of four that's kind of building on the other side. So yeah, I, I know we we're like I mean I, we did see as well that like. Robin and uh, Megan did go off together as well. So, right, so like, it is possible that you know, like, hundred percent, yeah, she could be in there with, yeah. with like the other, with uh, with the with like the other people, yeah. Like, so I think like keeping her on, like we can build a strong alliance because like this is her team now. Hundred percent, yeah. I will. All right, talk to you somebody. Yeah. Hey. All right. Hello. 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 All right. I like this walk. It's a good walk. I know. Yeah, okay. So, yeah, this is pretty crucial. Um, yeah, Evan and I, we are thinking about voting on Moira. Um, like, we're gonna be getting Conrad. So, I mean, like, I know you're still, like, yeah, it's like, still, still a newbie, but, like, honestly, like, I, I think, like, you'll be, you're very, very helpful in the team for this. Um, like, Conrad, he's very intelligent, too, so, like, I think he'll be able to, you know, handle any puzzles that do come our way as well down the road, too. Um, it's just unfortunate, like, the puzzle did not work out. Coming in from the swap as the lone original member of Rundle when everyone else was on the Yamneska squad, definitely I know that I'm at a disadvantage and I was clear about that with the team. I'm kind of trying to leverage some of the information that I have on the other team as an asset to keep me in the game. I'm not feeling particularly scared. I'd be sad if they voted me out and I would understand, but I do think I have a lot to bring and a lot to offer and I think that they see that. Conrad's a puzzle guy? Uh, Conrad definitely could be a puzzle guy, yeah. I, I think I think he would be like very good in that respect, so I mean like that's like part of the reason why like, like a trade-off doesn't seem as bad to me. Um, like, I, I'm not 100% tied to Evan, I'm sorry dude, but like, yeah. Because I know for sure. Oh yeah. Well, yeah. She's like, I'm assuming you're saying I'm telling you. Yeah. I'm gonna take you right now. Yeah. Okay. Okay. So you're gonna vote Evan. All right. Well, we'll see which way it goes, but kind of looks like we're pretty united on this one. So 
unless there's a pretty big blind sign coming at me, I think we're we're doing pretty all right. Um, gonna try to make a pretty big play, actually. I think it'll be a pretty bold uh, bold vote out here. So, yeah, fingers crossed that everything works out well. Tell me your thoughts, share your feelings. Um, we're kind of. I think our thought is like we're gonna get Conrad back. So if we vote out Megan, our tribe from the start is strong. Like we have the same amount of numbers as their tribe oh, from the start. I forgot we got back Conrad. Yeah, we get back Conrad. Every oh, sick. Okay, yeah. So yeah, Mitch and I were kind of thinking of voting out Megan because then we think we're Not sticking. me. No, because we want to stick with like our tribe lines. I think is kind of a thought. I'm now obviously an easy target to vote out since the puzzle didn't go great. Um, but, I mean, I don't know, unless people are pulling some sneaky shit, I'm, fingers crossed, still gonna be in the game. Tribal Council. All right, all right, all right. Amnuska, no matter what happens, I seem <laughs> to find you here. What is it like, even after the merge, coming right on back? It sucks. <laughs> Yeah, thought I'd seen the last few. <laughs> For now, at least. <laughs> Love you, Not Tom. But uh... <laughs> yeah, you barely got to know your tribe mates. But what was it like? Were you excited about the whole swap? Yeah, I mean, I had high hopes for us. Yeah, I mean, yeah. No, I, th I think like the swap was pretty good. I mean, like very happy with my teammates. But yeah, Megan, let's talk performance. Okay. Every team had a similar kind of struggle with the shooting. Obviously, you guys got through your donuts really quick, and then the puzzle seemed to be a problem for everyone. What do you think your team could have done better? Um, I think that we did the best that we could with the information that we had. I think everyone had kind of picked a point of the relay that we thought that we would be the strongest at, and there was no dispute about that. I think maybe um, the stress of kind of that time crunch at the end was hard for, I know it was hard for Moira, and so I know she definitely could have crushed that puzzle, but I think just the pressure and everything uh, kind of got in the way. Moira, do you think the pressure got to you in that last little bit of the challenge? It seemed towards the end of it that you maybe have lost your cool a little bit. What do you have to say about that? It was stressful for sure. Um, it was really frustrating too because I knew where the pieces were supposed to go. I just, I couldn't figure out how to get them there without like messing up the whole puzzle, which is probably the point of slide puzzles. Um, so yeah, that was that was frustrating and hard for sure. Um, especially after I killed the tree puzzle, <laughs> I was really looking forward to it. And yeah. Mitchell, do you feel like there is an area of the challenge where your team, a team member, didn't quite live up to their stuff? Slide puzzles are extremely difficult if you've if you've never done them before. And I mean, putting someone into the position of doing a slide puzzle that they haven't done before. I mean, like, it's very, very difficult for anybody. And so, like, I don't think it's a judge on, like, like, like the skill of, like, the skill of that person for performing in other areas as well. So, like, while, like, Moira might not have, like, been able to do the slide puzzle as quickly as, you know, may have liked, I don't think it's as much of a ju judge on her character and her skill level um, going forward with the rest of the game. Evan, you demolished those donuts, man. <laughs> I've been practicing for years. You put them years. in the dirt. <laughs> they didn't have a chance. How did you feel going back to your tribe after the challenge was said and done? How were your spirits looking back? I mean, honestly, I, I, I wasn't too upset because I know that were I in that situation, I don't think I could have done a slide puzzle anywhere near that well. So, like, it's hard to get upset at someone for, doing, for not being able to do something that I couldn't do myself. Like, I don't think that's any anything against them like I think everyone would have struggled with that it was a really tough challenge it was obviously a little disappointing to go back to tribal council but I don't think that is really to blame on anyone I think that's just the reality of the game kind of got to be ready for this situation you gotta you gotta handle it when it comes like everyone's gonna go to tribal council so they're all gonna have to do it at some point so hopefully just get it out of the way now and then uh, not have to come back here again for a while Megan there are even less of you on this tribe it's a dynamic shift when you guys lost the challenge, did you notice any of your tribe mates darting off into the woods, trying to grasp salvation while they still had a chance? <laughs> uh, no, actually. 
I don't know what, what more I can say about that. I think like there was more of like a. I think these guys are probably like I'm more new to coming back to tribal council, so I've, I've only been here once today. I know this is a repeat trip for these guys, so I think there was more of a. Don't have a personal. I feel attacked. Yeah. <sighs> Uh, what are we going to do again with this? And I was just ready to, I guess, approach, see what the moves were. Well, we're about to find out what those moves exactly will be. It's time to take some votes. Megan, you're up first. All right, I'll go read the votes. Now would be the time to play Hidden Amelia. Take your time. First vote cast. Moira. Second vote cast. Evan. That is one boy Moira. One boy Moira. Third vote cast. Evan. That is two votes Evan. One vote Moira. One vote remains. Fourth vote. Evan. You are the latest cast member to join our tribe out on the edge of intoxication. <laughs> Evan, better, huh? your tribe yeah. has spoken. Next time on Survivor Wipress, not one, but two challenges face the remaining survivors. And not one, not two, but three players will face the edge. Each tribe will be competing for individual immunity amongst themselves. Uh, honestly, I was kind of, I kind of had an idea in my head that that was going to happen. I, uh, I, I really wish we didn't lose that challenge, but I think I uh, annoyed Mitchell when we uh, voted out Eric, so I can see why that would come. But yeah, no, I know uh, I'm hoping to come back into the game with uh, through the edge, so I'm ready for that, mentally preparing.